the issue. Great battle for seventh place. Oh man, this is fun to watch. And at second place, a pair of teammates. Martin Truex, Kyle Busch. Truex has now dropped to three and a half off the lead. And Ryan Newman just ahead, one lap down. We'll see if second changes hands in these final five laps. How good is Kevin Harvick and how hard is he charging? There's only nine other cars left on the lead lap. That's unbelievable. The tear he's been on. There goes Kyle Busch to second place. Truex fighting back though on the outside. Wow. <laughs> Just sliding around at 180, 190 miles per hour, Mike. That's all. Right. So the Roush Fenway teammates, Newman up, our Roush Fenway teammates, Newman up high, and uh, his teammate Chris Busher has gone a lap down 21st. And Kurt's going after Jimmy Johnson. See those fresh tires on the 14 of Clint Boyer after having that right rear tire issue. And He's just having fun passing cars right now, taking out a little bit of his anger and frustration. And with our dynamic scoring, Jimmy Johnson had made it up into that top 12 in points until Kurt Busch passed him. Three to go. Matt Benedetto, we're told, had a tire coming apart and is now on the tail end of being one lap down. Well, and this, yeah, I know it's only two laps to go, but well, I'd be I'd be worried if I'm some of these guys about those tires, even with two laps to go. Joey Logano 25 seconds back is the last car on the lead lap. And the white flag is waving as we have one lap to go sponsored by Credit One Bank. And that is the mercy flag for the rest <laughs> of this field. Yeah this has been an impressive day. Kevin Harvick was strong at times but he and Rodney Childers had to work very hard to get their car back to the front and I give Kevin a lot of credit for how hard he pushed to take the lead away from Kyle Busch. We'll light that candles on Rodney Childers birthday cake because Kevin Harvick wins Atlanta. Great pit stop and what I don't know.